Hi, I'm Juno Prudhomme with Denison Yachting. Today we're on one of my new listing, a 2018 Boston Whaler 38 Outrage, powered with triple Mercury 350s. She has around 515 hours on her. She is lift kept at all times, no bottom paint, and we have custom covers for all the exterior upholstery. Uh, all her major services are up to standards and has been completed. We have service records on file. So here we are up in the bow where you have your U-shaped seating here, which is very nice and comfortable and spacious. You have your high-low table. Uh, what's nice is that you can put a sun pad out here. This will come down and convert to a full sun patch. So this area is very comfortable. You have a lot of room. You have these that pop up actually. And so that'll be your backrest, and you have that on both sides. What's nice, you have those handrails when the captain or the owner decides to go fast, and you're sitting here, you have some extra support just to hold on. You have your cleats all around as well. Non-skid up here, so if you are a fisherman, you can just come up here. Here's your anchor locker with your windlass. You have your controls and your crank handle as well, and you also have a wash down. So I like this nice surface area. You can stand up here easily two to three people. I would say two, just depending on your side, to go fishing. I'll pan back here to the bow area, just of this specific space. You're gonna have your cup holders here. Let me get down. You have one here, one on the opposite side. Let me pop this back down. Uh, we'll come back to that. That's gonna be your table here. I love this huge sun pad that's aft. You have two armrests, I have one down now, two cup holders. You have a charging station as well. So this is gonna be your sun pad area. Some of these, one thing you can add is a kind of a sun shade if you wanna get some clip-ons to have this bow area protected. As you can see, we have our FLIR with uh, Ray Marine. So you have uh, night vision as well. Big spreader light up top. Uh, down here is gonna be our storage pop that open so if you want to put some dive tanks in here portable grill you already have one aft uh, but if you want to add additional one you could so you have tons of space just for storage you can even probably put an inflatable paddleboard in here so a lot of room in this storage hatch all the upholstery is in great shape as I mentioned it's always fully covered here in the glass, you have this window that tilts up to give you some fresh air that will come through here at the helm station. So here you're gonna have your fusion controls. So you're able to control the music. You have your 12 volt outlet as well. And you have your bow table control. So this is for the high low table here. Um, so that way it can turn into a full sun pad. Again, this is always fully covered in great shape. You have two armrests. One here, one on the other side. Cup holders here. And this boat is loaded with JL sound system. It's all completely upgraded. It's not the standard package. Uh, the owner wanted to make sure the sound system was at peak performance. Storage compartments on both port and starboard. You have additionals moving closer to the helm. You have steps that go up to the hard top. So if you're wanting to add a little tower, if that's something you want to do, or even just fish up top, uh, you can do that. So that's a, a great upgrade. We do have eyes and glass covers. We don't keep them on right now, but we do have them here in storage just right above and you can easily uh, put that on. Here's a look at our JL sound systems. As you can see, it's all completely upgraded. You're going to have an isotherm fridge here. And then you're going to have three bolster seats. Again, as I mentioned, these are always covered. You have an electric actuator for that main seat there. This folds down, so that's a great advantage of just giving you better visibility here at the helm. Very comfortable uh, with the seating and all the material. You have your two Raymarine screens, 16 inch, a fusion radio, bow thruster, joystick control. You're gonna have your Mercury vessel view, your VHF, your Ritchie compass. So in terms of equipment, everything is there in great shape. You also have your two AC units uh, fans there if you want to keep the AC on and keep you nice and cool. So this is going to be a look at your helm and just all your electronics and your trim tab control as well. And right now we have the owner on board who is taking us 
around and it's been a lovely riding boat. So it's gonna let me just pan back here at the helm. Actually, I'll come back to the cabin. So back here, you're gonna have your cockpit table. You have your fold out transom bench seat here with your ladder that is underneath. The space back here, you can really feel it with the beam back here. It's, it's very spacious. And one thing I forgot to mention is your rocket launchers uh, that are back here. So you have five, so if you do wanna fish, it's set up. And you have additional rod holders on the side of the gunnels as well on both port and starboard. You're gonna have your electric awning that comes out. We'll cover this area back here and keep you nice and shaded with your spreader lights. So let me just pan back into the cockpit here. So back here is gonna be your summer kitchen. You have your sink, you're gonna have an electric grill as well. Everything's all in great working condition. You can kind of use this as a prep station just to get ready or you use the one that's there already. You're gonna have more storage. Just giving you the store, you have an abundance of storage here. So what's nice, this door swings open. just like that and your ladder will go into there, swing out and to come up, you kind of have this handheld that can help you getting out of the water. So in terms of the dive door, it's laid out very perfectly. You can jump in and out, have the ladder that's gonna hang over and be able to pull yourself out very easily. And especially if you're a diver or somebody who just likes a free dive, snorkel, go lobstering, being able to have this dive door is just a huge advantage of just getting on and off the boat. You're gonna have your cockpit shower that's right there. There's your ladder right underneath the transom bench seat. Obviously this folds away. I forgot to mention on your starboard side, additional seating that folds out. So you have that there. You have your starboard door here take you back to your mercury engines just gives you easy access for getting service and a big giant live well need to look at your fish boxes here tons of space goes all the way back I mean Marlins, Wahoos, I mean, I, I, I'm I, pretty sure I could fit myself in here. And you have that on both port and starboard side. Let's make our way down the cabin. I'm 6'1", I can easily stand up in here. My seating, obviously you can put some snacks, card games, two cup holders, enjoy some drinks. Somebody can easily sit here, this folds down turns into a full you can easily lay here very comfortably the thing to mention is these rod holders that clip in go into there go all the way across which is a nice finishing touch teak flooring you have your sink here storage well actually your microwave my apologies two cup holders Medic toilet, shower, so I can fit in here, tons of space, good stand-up room, and easily shower comfortably. So that is a good look at your cabin amenities. Everything's in stellar condition. So here's your bilge access, fuel lines, strainers. You actually have a Kohler generator. I mentioned Panda, my apologies. Most of them do come with a diesel Panda, but this one is your gas Kohler generator. Thank you for taking this walkthrough on the 2018 
Boston Whaler 38 Outrage. If you have any questions or like to schedule a private showing, please feel free to contact me anytime.